and the, your position. Also, I can't believe that it took you less time to pee than it did for me to read off the Raid Shadow Legends ad oh, script. I'm, I'm a quick pee. Yeah. That's that's impressive. Look, I'm gonna be honest. I have no idea what to do. There's an Enderman around here somewhere that's angry at me. <laughs> Look, I'm gonna be honest. Is it is it force or is it just length of time? Like, what's what's your secret? Um. Like, is it because... I know, I, know, I know what you mean. Like, is, am I, is it like a forceful urination? Or... Yeah, like, is it because you're spraying a fire hose? Or is it because the capacity of the normal hose is limited? Yeah, okay, I understand the question. I think my... How big is the swimming pool that you're draining? And oh, how large... Um, my bladder, I think, is quite small. A... The fire hose, though? Humongous. <laughs> always, nice. a good, always a good place to be. Always a good... Sp Good place to be. <laughs> um, I'm on the surface now. I thought I just saw a player, but it was flowers behind leaves, and I thought it was iron armor or something. Oh, <laughs> that scared me. Oh, boy. All right, I'm up on the surface. Life's good. Uh, time to try and get apples with these 1% apple rates. What do you think the play should be? Like, should I go to the top of like a mountain or something or you know i'm just keen to donate all of this gold to the next person to the first person who comes across me all this... i think i don't even know i feel like the pl the play is is to get to a place where you can get apples like get to the like the top of a big tall tree i'm at the top of a big tall mountain I mean, that's pretty close. Are there trees? Um, no. <laughs> well, then I don't even... There is a fortress up here. Yeah, because my thinking was if someone sees a big mountain, like, they're not going to want to climb it. I, see, I, I disagree. Remember in the beginning when you found that big, tall mountain? Yeah, but that was in the beginning. I feel like if someone saw a mountain, they'd be like... Oh, there's probably a fortress up there or something, and it's already been looted. That's true. But maybe not. Maybe I'm completely wrong. Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, my instincts in this, not very good. So, <laughs> <laughs> probably not a, not a great place to be. Oh, I'm trying to craft an axe with an enchanting table. That's sick, though, that you got a chance. I think I'd be a bit disappointed in myself if I didn't. Um, no diamond armor, though, just a diamond sword. Hmm. Which, you know, can't be helped, really. But it's sharpness one, so that's. Sharpness that's okay. two. <gasps> Your boy did it. Oh. Let's see if these leaves despawn, because I'm not sure if they will. I don't think they will. I think they're all... Um, you know, I think almost all of the leaves are, are big, uh, big placed, you know? Yeah. You know what I might do? I might go right to the edge of the map, go right out to the border, set up a little island and go fishing. I'll get the most OP bow, and I'll pass away instantly with it. I think you could just go back to our spawn. That seems a bit dangerous, though. It's quite far away. That's true. But so is the world border. Um, what am I at now? I'm at... Oh, actually, I'm kind of... I'm actually... I see the ocean. Like, the edge. Um, I mean... You were at, what, like, 400, negative 1100, or something well, like right that? Right now, I'm at negative 1000. I, I ran a little bit. So I feel like being this far out would be good. I don't think a lot of people are going to be walking around the edge of the map. Yeah. I think it'd be better to be further <laughs> from the edge of the map. Because I think there's probably people that go around the edge of the map and people who go towards the center. I don't think many people... Because it's a large island. I think they'd, they'd move in a little bit and just kind of wander. I don't think they'd like circle the whole island. 
But, I mean, if you're saying people might do it, then people might do it. I don't know. I mean, I wouldn't. I would do it. (laughs) Yeah, that's what I mean. If you're saying it, then it could be possible. People on the edges, and I would feel better about facing people that were scared enough to go to the edge. That's true. You know what's also true? I have zero apples. Yeah, so maybe going to a mushroom island isn't a good idea. Can you fish out apples? I don't think so. Probably. No, I don't think so. Well, apple rates suck. What do I need? I need like eight. I need eight apples. Jesus Christ, you have a stack of gold? A stack and six. Oh my god. But you see what I mean? Like, the person who comes across me next is just gonna obliterate me, and then I'll be donating a stack of gold, probably contributing to their win. Yeah. No, that's definitely not a good spot to be. If I see someone, I'm just gonna type, oh, sorry, I'm lagging, hang on a second. (laughs) And just sit here for a second and think about what's going on. (laughs) Just log out. (laughs) Yeah, just go downstairs, make myself a coffee or something. All right, well, I'm almost done Like, Give me one sec. <laughs> so close to finishing. <laughs> um, I cut down maybe like four or five trees and I have no apples. I got two apples relatively quickly just from punching leaves, but... Really? Yeah. Um... Make like a, a, an extra sword of some sort and then just go through, you know? The swords do it like I that think... much quicker? I think I think swords do it a decent bit quicker, and you know over time that adds up. That's true. I think sword you know, it's like um a little bit faster, like a like it's marginally faster. Yeah, it's a little bit quicker actually. Putting um extra extra efficiency at the margin is one of the most important things. Marginal utility, baby. I just feel so much better even if I had one gamble. Just one. Yeah, just to get is absorption on? I don't think Actually, it is, no. I don't yeah, as I would say, I don't think there Ooh. is. Jared just died to Dipscraft. Oh, and Quill Ooh. Justin just got killed. I get so bad at calling people by their real names versus their Minecraft names. Yeah. It definitely doesn't help that I've always gone by flop, and now I don't have that account. And it's like, my name is Michael. (laughs) And that's the name of my (laughs) username. But I'm sure it'll be fine. It's also almost exactly like the um, Michael from Mindcrack. Yeah, it is. This was M H Y K O L and mine's M Y K O H L. Very similar. Yeah. Also, I'm gonna it's, call uh, I'm gonna call bullshit. I don't think apples drop from all leaves. Because I'll tell you what. Yeah, I have no idea. These jungle leaves are not doing it for me. Oh, I, I break an oak leaf and I get an apple straight away. Yeah, I I got a pretty good amount, I think. From like oak leaves or yeah i mean i i just don't think that i broke that many okay so that's gaffle number one maybe yeah maybe gosh probably less than half a stack of leaves really i mean unless i'm just an idiot and i was breaking leaves for a long time you were running while i did that so maybe i was just um thinking oh just yeah i got two apples now Alright. Well, hey, you know, don't tempt fate. Just keep going with the oak leaves. Okay, let's check the tab, see how everybody's doing. Everyone seems to be doing alright. No one is extremely low by the looks of it. A lot of, uh, single people. Um, so there's Alex. And myself. And that's it, I think. Really? Did Garrett's yeah. teammate already die? Uh, who was Garrett's teammate? Ben. 
Oh yeah, he died early. He, he died while I was still alive. So yeah. Also, this terrain is going to be such aids to fight in. Oh yeah, with all the big trees like, and yeah, shit. the leaves and whatever. Like it's going to be yeah. so bad. Quick, change your graphics to fast on transparent blocks. <laughs> and like people could just sneak up on you, and you wouldn't even see them until it's just too late. I don't know about that. I don't think that's possible. That people sneak up on you, and then you wouldn't see them until it's too late. I just don't think that that could happen. Well, I'm, I'm cutting down trees with my back turned, I mean. Yeah, I just think, you know. Look, you might be a pro Minecrafter, but I have some <laughs> issues. I'm going to make some boats, actually. In case I have to... Really... You know, give someone the slip. Yeah. I could just go to the ocean and... Bye. Dang, so now you have two viable options of... How to get away from someone. Yeah, and the lava bucket for lava suicide? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, lava bucket for uh, fire resist potion. Oh, right, right. Fake suicide. Huh? I mean, I'll keep the lava bucket, I mean, the fire resistance potion on my hot bar in case I ever have to, you know, use it after walking into someone's lava. <laughs> Could you imagine running into someone, though, and then just watching them dig two blocks down, place a lava bucket over their head, and then splash themselves with a fire resist potion? There's a couple of people in here that I can imagine doing that. <laughs> That's sick. <laughs> That'd be so dope. <laughs> Uh, Curry was shot by Joey Kin. Ooh, the real Joey. Yeah. I'd... And Nick was slain by Joey. They're Joey gets at... a quick double kill. Joey and Mike are at six hearts each. Yeah, but they just got two more heads. Yeah. Um, if they don't heal up, though, they'll probably That's... go caving and they'll come late to like a meetup and then they'll have healing and they'll win. Healing and good armor. I'm sure they do by this point. Yeah. Not on my accord. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, well, I guess maybe if they're rocking a chain chest plate, you know that I had something to do with this game. <laughs> yeah, if I see him running around in that, I'll be like, God damn it. Um, Alright, so also, I've got be... four apples. That's pretty good. Yeah, it's alright. So just double the amount of time I've already taken, and I'll have eight. Yeah, which hasn't been long that you've been doing oak leaves, right? Just a couple yeah, minutes. Yeah, just, just oak. Are you in, like, a jungle biome, or what? I don't know what you'd call this biome. Something. Mm, oh. let, me, let me think. I mean, yeah, it, so it, it is jungle, but it doesn't look like a jungle. Hmm. Would you consider it one of the five major types of biomes? Well, it's a, it looks like a custom biome to me. No, no, I was trying to think in terms of actual geography. Oh, um, I, I would think say... There's... Yes. Water. Water is definitely up there. Plains. And then I can't remember if it's Rainforest or forest, and then there's tundra desert. Or something. Yeah, and tundra. There's definitely five. I learned about this in geology. I swear to God. Geology or geography? Yeah, in geology, because they were talking about how what the different the heck? five, the different five major biomes are more conducive to finding specific types of rocks in them, and how whatever specific type of biome is the most likely for oil to be formed in uh -huh. and then if you want to find you know fossils or some shit it would you would need to you would like for it to be um, in whatever biome i don't know there's a bunch of really hardcore different types of insane biomes though i know i live in a weird one it's called a chaparral which is kind of um 
kind of like the Minecraft equivalent of the, uh, what's, what's the, the savannah? You live in a savannah? Not exactly. I live, but I live in a, in kind of a mixture, kind of a, a, What do you live in like Africa or something? What's going on? Nah, I live like halfway between a, a forest and a desert. Uh, you know what? I'm going to look it up. Chaparral biome. As it turns out, I had some gold ore so I can actually make nine apples. Fucking hell yeah. So now I just need four more apples and I have five apples. Um, still won't well, save some for heads when you kill like seven people. I don't think you know? I'm going to save any gold for heads. Oh, alright. I don't think I'll get the opportunity. Well, I'll give you a quick fun fact. The Chaparral, also known as the Mediterranean Forest, Mm -hmm. and shrub is a temperate bio Ooh. characterized by hot dry summers and mild and rainy winters so let me think of i, I know that so your bo the biome of where you live in is based off of your longitude latitude yeah. based on the latitude around the earth um so southern california is on a similar latitude to Italy. So that's probably why they say Mediterranean forests um, for Chaparral, even though it's California as well. I wonder. So you're living in the same biome as some Italians. Yeah, that's why uh, wine from California is so well known. I bet there's some Chaparral in Australia. I mean, probably. Chaparral in Australia. Yeah, the chaparral biome of Australia contains mainly, mainly dwarf eucalyptus trees. Australian chaparral. Huh. That's probably where the Australian wine country is. Yeah, probably, actually. Would it's be my guess. Because it's, yeah, uh, the chaparral biome's great because it's, um, as long as you can import water, it's never going to get cold enough to destroy grapevines uh and it's also not going to be actually just north of chaparral should be better for growing wine well look next time i'm thinking about growing wine uh i'll make sure that's it's saying, slightly north. Biomes, is, biomes is such an interesting thing to know about where you live i think i live in like a coastal Coastal biome? I don't know what you call that. Well, I know there's water or aquatic biomes. It's like one of the main five categories. Now I'm going to look it up for Australia. I want to know. There are three main biomes. Desert, savanna, and tropical. I think it's... Tropical... Yeah, I think it's about... Um, actually, maybe tropical's further north. But I'm not in like a savanna. Consists... Okay, this one actually has four. I guess maps differ in their thoughts. Um, it looks like in Victoria, most of southern Victoria is temperate broadleaf and mixed forest. And that goes all the way up the west or the east coast. Uh -huh. and then Victoria up, or all of Australia? Uh, all the way through New South Wales. And for the first third of the coast in Queensland. Alright, so that's me then. And then it turns into tropical and subtropical moist broadleaf forests along that edge. Um, looks like in the starting, you know, just like a third of the way up. I, I don't know what um, city that would be. Um, Queensland's like pretty just big. Just north of, north of Brisbane? Right, Just Brisbane north of is Brisbane, like uh... a good, a decent bit north of Brisbane. Brisbane's right; it's kind of close to the, but it's not the closest city to the border, right? Um, Between no, the Queensland Gold... and New South Wales. Well, technically no. I guess the Gold Coast would be. But they're like right next to each other. Uh, it's like an hour drive, or maybe less. Okay, so you know, uh, we're about to get into real bad geography terms you know the little like 
um, kind of horn coming out just north of Brisbane. Kinda. Okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna try. All right, well, it's the end of the episode. Oh, sweet.